Hello, my most awesome literacy students. It is a uh, terrific Thursday, a thankful Thursday. Lots of wonderful things happen on Thursday. It is a beautiful day out, so I hope you can get to spend some time outside. Today, we are going to continue looking at our punctuation. So punctuation is the three ones that we're looking at. There's lots of kind of punctuation. We're looking at end of the of the thought punctuation. So the first one is period. So it's the telling type sentences. This is the most common that you'll see. Asking is the question mark. And then yelling is the exclamation mark. So it's a command or a strong emotion. All right, so we're gonna do a little bit of work with this. I think you guys are getting okay with that. That's not too much trouble. Uh, and we're going to focus on some questions. So we're really going to look at, so we have done, I'm gonna just put this down a second. Pop my lid off. Pick it back up again. Here we go. So these are the kinds of sentences that we're working on. So we're gonna continue working on these. So we've got the who. And remember, who does not have to be a person. It, it, it is a noun for sure, but it is um, the main character. So yesterday you had one that was the unicorn. So it's the who, the what, and you're pretty good at the what, what's going on. The main uh, idea yesterday, you had um, the unicorn was walking through the forest. So that was, what were they doing? They were walking. So the when has to do with time. And so the easiest questions usually are the when and the where. So the time, yesterday. Uh, Friday, four o'clock, anything that has to do with time is the when. The where is the place. So it doesn't necessarily have to be a, um, a building, but it's where is this taking place? So it might be another country. Um, yesterday we had the unicorn walking in the forest. Um, it could be in the building, on the bed. Where is that taking place? Then we have the why. And that's a usually a little bit more difficult. It's usually a broader kind of question. And then the how. So we're going to look at these for the next couple of days. You got really good at the punctuation. You've got that. So now we're going to take a look at what are some of the questions that we're going to ask. So we're looking at that and there's a couple, oh, and then we're continuing with our sentences, subject and predicate, all kinds of good stuff today. Don't forget to finish it off with some Fred and have a super awesome day. Take care. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.